We have some breaking news right now. Reports of multiple shots fired near the Showplace Icon Theater in the South Loop. Fox 32's Nate Rogers just getting to the scene right now. Nate, what can you tell us? Well, that's right, Dane. Um, police right now are actually wrapping up the scene. In fact, all of this is taking place right here um, at the Icon Theater along Roosevelt Road. I'm going to step out of the way just so you all can somewhat get a glimpse of what we're seeing from this vantage point. Now, I'll let you know that the Icon Theater is located about a thousand feet from where I'm standing right now. And we did get somewhat of an update from police sources just within the last five minutes or so. They're telling us that this all began as an altercation between two men outside of the theater. We're told that two men began arguing outside of the theater. Then once they went inside of the theater, um, police sources say a physical dispute then ensued in the midst of that fight happening. We're told again by police sources that a gun somehow fell out of one of the guy's um, waist, if you will, and fell on the ground. Um, as a result, um, police are telling us that one of the gentlemen put, picked up that gun and fired at least seven gunshots in the air. We spoke to a couple of folks that were inside of the theater at the time. Um, they told us they heard at least 10 gunshots that sounded off at the time. Now, throughout all of this, um, the folks inside of the movie theater had to evacuate the theater um, as soon as possible. Police were told were on hand within um, three minutes, if you will. Police are saying that there were no injuries in all of this, that those two um, folks that were apparently fighting, um, that they have been taken into custody and, and at least right now are being questioned by police. But the most frantic piece, all of this happening while we're told some 700 people were inside of the theater at the time. Um, there was one woman who apparently suffered a medical episode as a result of all of this as Chicago police were working to get folks outside of the theater. Many folks left their keys behind, their cell phones, their wallet, everyone just running to safety because they were not sure at the time where those gunshots were originating from and if someone was hurt. But again, um, back out here live, we are learning from police that uh, there were no gunshot victims, if you will, just that one woman, we're told, who suffered a medical um, episode. Um, again, the theater is shut down. Theater management is advising all of the patrons that were inside that they can come back tomorrow. They can come back tomorrow to retrieve those belongings that were left behind. Again, we're still trying to get additional information from police on all of this. Of course, when we learn more, we'll be sure to update you on air and online. In the South Loop, Nate Rogers, Fox 32, Chicago.